Joker's Tunnel uh, was actually sort of named that way because it was a bit of a scam. It was built in 1896 by local prospectors, but it was actually funded by English investors. Um, plenty of people in England had plenty of money to spend and investing it in the gold rush seemed a good way of doing it. Uh, but the prospectors that actually dug the tunnel knew there was no gold there, uh, yet they had big money coming in from the investors. So to show they were, show they were actually doing something, they, they dug this tunnel and people put the money in. Uh, these guys made a, a lot of money out of it, got no gold out of it. And when they finished the mine, uh, pretty much told the investors, sorry, there's no gold, but yet they made an absolute fortune by doing it. So it became known as the joke was on the investors. Um, to visit there, it's, yeah, definitely worth a bit of a look. For, for a big hole, there was absolutely, absolutely no profit for anyone out of it except the people doing the work, which is what it was designed for. So, quite a good scam from one country to another, really. We have the Joker's Tunnel. Survey point there. And here we have the entrance. as well apparently. Well worth a look. Pretty cool colours in the in the dirt or the rock.
new yellowy red into a blue hard rock. Short drive around from the car park, you can access the other entry on the southern side of the hill, um, which is quite easy to get to with a short drive. And the actual road in is only about 10 minutes off the main road from Yelgu to Mel Geraldton to Mount Magnet. Uh, it's signposted there, probably 10 k's of bitumen, then a couple of k's of dirt in at the mine site. Uh, quite an easy drive. Uh, it's just a typical red, rocky surface. Uh, a couple, bit of flood damage here at the moment to get through, but quite an easy trip in. got this far thanks for watching um, I quite enjoyed doing a little bit of film work whilst I'm visiting a lot of these places just out of interest in our Australian history so if you like these let me know I'll keep doing a few more and yeah 
here in bits and pieces of Australia that you generally never hear of. Thanks for watching.